Well, welcome everybody. You join us here for our coverage of what is set to be a truly exciting final. Formalities are underway. Everybody is soaking up an energetic, highly charged atmosphere within the ground. The teams will be with us very shortly. We look forward, of course, to that special moment. In the meantime, we take in the feeling of excitement and euphoria ahead of what should be a really outstanding final. This famous, famous stadium, for so long, one of the symbols of Italian dominance in Europe. Both teams, Jim, eyeing the ultimate prize here, unerring focus and determination in all of those eyes. Bringing back memories for me, Peter, a chance to have your name in the club's history. Having had the privilege of experiencing this uh, a fair few times in my own career, there really is nothing that compares. Once you get there, you want to keep coming back. I still feel like that now. gets on the way as with a lot of finals caution plays a big part in the opening stages but an early goal can blow all that away so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here which, which obviously we want for this showpiece no messing about just bludgeoned away Busquets battles to win it back that's a throw Bernat. Bernat proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Dion. Dion. Aguero is flag offside. Piquet. Very little to choose between them, but very early days. Roberto. Dumpele. Roberto. Paris Saint-Germain pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's, that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's, it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. And it's been taken straight back. Di Maria has got himself a free kick. Pass 
needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And it's Bernat. And here's Neymar. It's wrestled off the ball. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Hoists it forward. Neymar. That intervention was very necessary. Messi with the short one. One way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. The ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Bernat plays it forward. He gets past his man. Sergio Busquets. And it's Aguero. Well, both sides have actually looked poor going forward. We've hardly seen anything meaningful yet. It's a brilliant interception. Draxler. Sergio Ramos tries to get it forward quickly. And he has been fouled there. The ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Bernat. And he's there to cut it out. Roberto drives it forward. And it's Draxler. And that's been one straight back. Chance to break. Forward it goes. Sergio Ramos gets his foot in there. Oh, it's Dembele. Dembele gets the better of his man. Header! No, he didn't quite meet it right. All he'll be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. Paris Saint-Germain get it back again. Camilo Pereira. And the Herrera. Busquets with a good steal, well played. Fatty plays it out to the wing. Timely intervention. Draxler. Messi. Now it's Di Maria. Well, there's the whistle. First half of the final has flown by. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Look, this is classic final tension and, and nerves. Um, it's still got time to go from tentative to thrilling, I hope. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Barcelona can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Marco Verratti. Hakimi. Just brushed off the ball there. And it's played forward. Pereira does well to read it and intercepts. Messi shoots! It's there! Well, this guy is just not your average footballer. Alert and sharp. And while one or two others were still digesting the manager's half-time team talk, he's already delivering another lead. What a good player. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled.
big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Neymar. Bernat. And it's Messi. He's found his man. Draxler. In comes the corner. To safety. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Di Maria. Sergio Busquets. And it's Dion. Jordi Alba. He's got options out wide. Plenty waiting in the middle. Jordi Alba. Barcelona showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. I hope it's just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Bernat. Bernat goes looking. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Roberto, forward it goes. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. De Jong gets it back. Real chance! Goal! Barcelona! Barcelona are back in business. Well, oh, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot on sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from where I'm sitting. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. That has certainly made things interesting. Ah, oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and uh, I still haven't moved. Neymar pins it out wide. Up he gets! Goal, Paris Saint-Germain! And they've got their lead back. What a super header, dispatched beautifully. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Barcelona are making a change now. Aguero, got amongst the goals, he's being taken off now. Well, has he done enough since his goal? Is the feeling that he's lost his appetite for another? It's difficult to be sure exactly what the thinking is, but his race has certainly run now. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. He spotted the run and played him through. Sergio Busquets. with a delicate ball 
Good idea, just poorly executed. Donnarumma gets it upfield. Now it's Messi. And he's on his way! This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Lumps it in gently. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Now it's Di Maria. Out to the left it goes. Can't get the better of his opposite number. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Now, hits one! It's in! They have stolen level at the last! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. All square again into the dying minutes. Longley plays a clever pass. Keira. Pereira plays it forward. Now it's Neymar. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Four added minutes on the board. Tries to dink it in. Now it's Philippe Coutinho. He's left his man. Nothing to separate them. We have extra time. And it's been a contest between two sides that were evenly matched on the day. Neither deserves to be on the losing side. Well, fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. The whistle goes, we're off and running. Barcelona displayed great resilience to find the late equaliser that's got them here. Now can they go one better? Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Sergio Busquets looks to clip it forward. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Fatty goes long. Marquinhos gets it away. Keira, who does have an assist to his name. Now it's Neymar. Neymar opts to play. Ramos! And that's a real chance missed. Well, we could be headed for a scenario in which next goal is the winner. That chance could have been it too. Time for a change in personnel. Zion, Coutinho. Jordi Alba is charging up on the overlap. Oh, and he's asking too much with that.
Marquinhos tries to get it forward quickly. Keeper sends it forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Marquinhos. Cuts it out. Extra time reaches half time. Well, there's plenty of potential for a final twist in this tale. I think there's bound to be some late drama in the final 15 minutes of this epic. And we're up and running. The last 15 minutes, the closing stretch of a marathon final. Ter Stegen sends that a long way. Danilo Pereira. And it's played forward. And now they can launch a counter. De Jong tries lifting it over. Just, he's had a go! Oh, yes, it's there! Late in the day, this could well be it! Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. Barcelona take the lead. I think this team shows great willpower and a wonderful never-say-die attitude. No other outfit can match them. They just keep going. Superb. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Longley. has got good distance on that. Marquinhos gets it back. Kozawa drives it forward. And the weighted pass. Well read, he sorted that out. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation. And it needs to be any time now, really. Coutinho hits that long. Has a pop! Oh, denied! Brilliantly! Braithwaite really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. <laughs> Tries to get it clear. So that's it. It is all over. Barcelona have done it here. Winners of the Konami Cup. A massive moment in their lives. What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.